Oh my gosh, I need to watch Blue's Clues now. <laughs> or is that from Blue's Clues? Hey everyone, it's Holy Ball and welcome back to my channel. Now yes, I know this vlog for my college life is not on a Thursday like it usually is. Or Thursday, Friday. It's been so long. <laughs> Anyway, uh, Vita has kind of like mixed up my schedule and because I want to make all these videos so I don't have to worry about anything during finals. Oh, what can I do? I'm sorry. But like after, <laughs> after Vita, everything will go back to normal. I'll be uploading every two weeks like usual. But I may have to take a break right after school so that my summer schedule is not bit. So let's start with the video. Uh, I want a scholarship. It's like lit. Oh, I don't. I just said lit. I never say lit. I'm. I'm just like that happy. <laughs> Thanks to my awesome, awesome, awesome best friend for helping me edit the paper, and uh, like me just like sitting down and getting my thoughts. I have to say Chromebooks. Awesome. If you if you need like no distractions, yes, Google and the internet are on there. But I don't have the Sim City on there. I don't have my editing programs on there. I don't have anything on there that saved like my bookmarks and all I do is study on that thing. I'm probably gonna get one. I'm probably I'm vouching for it. I was like if you need distraction free and you're like me and you can like deal with it if the program's not on there, do it. Just do it. But yeah, I got a huge scholarship. It's not super big and it's not the highest amount that they uh uh would give but they did give me <laughs> enough to like help me focus a lot more on school and not worry about my financial obligations at school too much because it's been stressing me and my family out and it's just like college is expensive but nowadays for some jobs especially if it's a job you're passionate about you just gotta you just gotta do it unfortunately and I wish it really wasn't that way but I just now that I'm sure of myself, I really wish I was sure when I was 17, but it is what it is. You learn when you grow, but uh, yeah, that happened. Um, what else happened in my life? I've actually not been paying attention to um, weight training. I haven't been to the gym since the last time I went. I haven't ran since the week after spring break, so that was like, Three weeks ago now so bad I like if the snow day canceled my counseling session and this was the first one after a while where I was like I'm fine we can do monthly visits we can't do monthly visits anymore it's gonna be every two weeks or at least every three weeks because that well-timed snow that I was like it's not gonna happen it happened it happened and it really screwed me over so luckily because photography is also another way that I get my relaxation on I just managed to get a camera from my school and just you know try it out because oh my gosh I never thought I'd actually really need counseling it's really helped me a lot and I really need to go back it's, it's, it's nice to talk to someone and vent I mean it's nice to do this too like vlogging but I personally need reciprocal feedback and my counselor is really good at that I got lucky on the first try like they're just like you want to try her it's like sure sure and yeah she's awesome so <laughs> yeah we are in the home stretch for finals and in general the end of the semester after this week it's basically the uh, last month of school now, unfortunately, I have exams, I think, um, all the way to the last day of school. Actually, let me check. So, I just realized I don't actually have my final exam schedule on my phone. I should probably change that. Let me, let me try. So, I have a Friday and a Monday exam. So, I'm stuck here until the second to last day before school ends unfortunately and it's like I'm always stuck on those days there's no like way to like organize it because by the time they have the final exam schedule up for fall time it's pretty much the end of summer and you can't exactly just like make your schedule around that so 
it is what it is but if i'm looking at like how they organize it i may get lucky and like leave early next fall who knows no the last thing is basically instagram related and it's kind of two in one things so i have three new apps that i absolutely love with instagram and it's really helping up in my Instagram game. So the first one is Pocket Poser Pro. I did have a credit for actually um, buying it, so I kind of sort of got it for free. Not from them, but you know, gotta use that Google Play credit when you can. But it really helps me think about how I should like organize my body, not organize, I pose my body in a way that's more natural and uh, just you know works because I can't pose to save my life. And even though my my pictures from that one time were pretty awesome. I want to do more, you know? I don't I don't want to just be static. Um, another one that I actually found is something called Focal Mark. Now, it, you can't really see that well, but this is what it looks like. You can choose the style of the hashtags, the location of the hashtags if it matters. So like, hashtag DC or hashtag Baltimore. And then the camera. If you're in photography or something like that and you're like Canon photography, that kind of thing, since I use a Canon. Um, and it actually helps you generate a certain amount of Instagram hashtags. Is that cool? And you can copy it to Instagram, you can copy it straight to your clipboard and whatnot. You can shuffle them. And if you pay for like the um, pro version, you can actually tweak all of these hashtags like how many ones you want for equipment how many you want for location different things like that and last but not least is the app i can't really say the name but i'm gonna assume it's unum so it it looks weird yes but this is my instagram feed currently as of right now and it oh my gosh this app is amazing i saw it on a facebook group that i'm a part of that helps you grow your instagram and the plan I use for later is the free one and it does not give you analytics and to get analytics you have to sign up for a business account which means I have to give my phone number out and I also have to give my email out or make another email and I don't need any more emails I have six and I'm about to make a blog at that seven no no it's not happening so I actually was told about this app so these are actually the analytics for my um, posts it shows which one is my top post. It shows when is the best time for me to post because I currently post at 11.55 p.m. because I'm assuming, hey, everyone's going to lunch. Then I realize lunchtime is not really a thing anymore. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, so what are you gonna do? And it also tells me which of my posts have the best received hashtags in general. And this is all for free. It's currently on a public beta, so I'll let you know in the description but anyway it's good anyway that's it for this video i know it's a lot of stuff at once but then again i haven't really posted <laughs> in a while for one of these vlogs well i hope you've managed to get through all of it i'm sorry for <laughs> talking so much but these are my videos where i get to like ramble a lot but not excessively anyway i'll see you guys next time or tomorrow actually since it's vita and yeah, stay cool, stay fresh.